Most of us know our tragedy. We see it, but we're too lazy to do anything about it. One sees the tragedy, the misery, the confusion, the uncertainty, and we are too lazy to clear it up. Is that it? Then please take some vitamins, <laughs> put some guts into you and wake up. It's not a problem, sir. If you want to do something, you do it. You wanted to come here and you took all the trouble to come here. You have enough energy to do something when you want to do. But we don't apparently want to do this. Can you first realize, if I may suggest, that our minds have become so imitative, right? Do you realize that, sir? Conforming, obeying, so that we are never uh, original, find out for ourselves. So can you put away what the psychologists have said, what your Gita has said, what other books have said, say, look, I'm going to find out for myself. Won't you do that? No, you won't. Because if you follow others, you think that's the easiest way to solve life. And you have followed for millennia, and you are still where you are. Right? Why does the brain, your brain, form habits? Hmm? That's right. It says for convenience, for comfort, for following daily certain routine, both physically and as well as mentally psychologically. Why? Because the mind has found the habit convenient, it hasn't to work anew again, and so it fo habit is formed, which means routine, a machine.